hardest part of the uh, <laughs> being on the reality show is a lot of people don't care because they're paid, you know, to be around you. <laughs> and, uh, it doesn't matter how sick you are, how autistic you are, <laughs> you know, I guess they have their, uh, rules or whatever they're told <laughs> you know it's harder and harder and more depressing with each emotional abuse I go through um that to me is <laughs> the hardest to come from <laughs> um you know, I'll get these texts from, I guess, the person that texts me is the director or the writer. And they're completely different from the character that I meet, you know. Um, the text will promise things like some very elaborate things to just simple things. And I'll either call the person or meet the person and they have no idea what I'm talking about or say, oh, this isn't possible, you know. So it's <laughs> extremely manipulative. And for someone that reads everyone at face value, it's cruel. It's incredibly cruel. And uh, every time I get attached to people, I sincerely care about people. I don't act. I care about people or love them or see them for their whole being. But they don't care about me. <laughs> it's so horrible. Um, the inventor or the creator of the show had to be a narcissist, and then I don't know. You know, I you're not allowed to say this is wrong. Um, you're not allowed to say somebody cares about you that doesn't want this to happen. You're not allowed to have anybody in your corner, you know. Um, they can uh, be made fun of as well, you know. Your real family like Bob and Joan can be made fun of <laughs> or harm. I said, you know, well, why doesn't your family care about you or take care of you? I'm obviously very sick. My bladder wouldn't work today. Uh, emotional stress is the hardest thing on my body. I swear to God, uh, it, uh, people are mean to me. Something always happens. And, uh, sometimes people ask, well, why are you drinking alcohol at eight in the morning? Well, I'm trying to get my bladder to work, you know? Um, I'm sick. I'm a very sick person. It is taking advantage of me. You are taking advantage of me. And uh, then they'll be like, oh, well, this is what America wanted. America wanted to see you cry or get angry or thrown out of a house or yell at a man or be a hero or stand up for yourself. I'm too sick for that. Fuck America, you know. And I'm sure a lot of Americans say, no, we don't want that. We want her to be left alone. But sometimes that's what the producers, the directors will say, well, this is what America wanted. They wanted to see, you know, tell off a guy or, you know, uh, lose a friendship or, uh, they tell me that all the time, you know, well, America wants to see you starve or not have what you need. And I, I, I can't believe that's completely true, you know, and, uh, I just, I worry so much about the people that actually do care about me, and it, emotional abuse is the harder, the hardest thing for me to recover from, you know, I, I am very sincere, and I care about people, and I, I give a lot of people grace, maybe, that I shouldn't, and then I, knowing that people are directing them, 